Alright, so we just got the Millennium Falcon map. And I'm the only one who has it downloaded, so I'm gonna play it while they download it. And I suck at zombies, so it should be fun. <laughs> you got some high confidence there. Hold on a second. And I'm playing on Kill House, the map that me and Bo own. But Jared doesn't yet. He's going to download it after Millennium Falcon. And then we're going to be playing a lot of Millennium Falcon and Kill House today. Kill House. You made that joke. Jump knife. Yeah, but I didn't do it on camera. And I just realized I forgot to start my timer, but it doesn't matter because I record these in attempts. And they should be pretty short attempts. What? Alright, let's see. What weapon do I start with? What are your options? Oh, 1911. Oh. Alright, let's I, see. There's one map I played on called, like, Raze, and you can start with three options. You can get, like, uh, the 1911, the ASP, or the CZ. I obviously went with the CZ, because what else would you go with? Okay. Yeah, it's the only one that doesn't okay, suck. Okay, there's an M1 carbine here for 600, so you only need to get 100 points to get it. You can either start with the 1911, the C96, the death machine. That'd be cool <laughs> if they changed the zombies to look like stormtroopers. Did they? I survived two rounds. <laughs> I think it said, like, on the... Age for the Millennium Falcon map that the player models are stormtroopers. Oh, the player models are. That's cool. What if I had Star Wars guns? Yeah, but wait. If we're on the Millennium Falcon, why would we be stormtroopers? Why would not question it. Why wouldn't we be like Han Solo, Princess Leia, Luke, and Chewbacca? Alright, everyone. I guess we're gonna end this episode. I think that we should.